Oh, that worked. Gia. Sounds like a podcast habit. True. I'm not ready to be in a podcast with Zane. I realize this is funny that I like Zane entirely way too much. So I gotta just start hating him a little more. I gotta do like the Jordan. I just like him way too much. You think Zane likes me when he's fucking back throw gimping me? You think he gives a fuck about me, my family, my lineage, where I'm from? Our friendship? Fuck no. He said, fuck this pussy. Probably calls me a beaner in his head. He said, fuck this Mexican. What the damn. <laughs> Fuck this little Mexican fuck. Ah! Oh. I thought we were friends. Oh! Zane, no! <laughs> Zane, why you gotta do me like that? Didn't know it was like that, Zane. <laughs> Winner's coming. Hi, Bella winner. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Here, come at me some respect, dog. Guess I should be thankful. I'm doing it. All the other sheiks are way too defensive. Just run this motherfucker. Watch this. Oh fuck. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, baby. <laughs> he didn't want to hit this. Dense fire. Oh, he, he, he ran for it. <laughs> Did my dense fire. Where is Link? You're going to let him run through me like that, Link? You're going to let him run through your bench way. She, she's trying to hit a little dense fire? What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, baby! Grab that. That's one. That's two. That's three. <laughs> That's four, motherfucker. Axe, I think, um... So I think right now, okay, who did bad? I think Axe and Plop out of this world underperform. Lorzenzo. Thanks, man. Um, Axe, I think. Okay, here's what I always think. And this is in the bottom of my heart, honestly, about Axe. Is I think Pikachu sucks dick. I'm talking big old Nintendo donkey. Uh, Pikachu sucks. Uh, that's just how it goes. That character is not good. I watch an axe match and it's the saddest thing. Cody, this is a generation of people who do this. Guess what that does? You know what that does? That shits on Pikachu, guys. Everyone holds down. So I watch axe play a set. He just gets CC'd 80% of the game. I'm like, he tries to grab. It's like, look, what the fuck? What is he supposed to do? This is little fucking stupid arm. Like, we're not done yet. Thank you, Ben Zhao. Like, I think Axe is an amazing player, but in this generation of downholders, I don't see what Axe is gonna do. I have thought this about Axe many times, and then he always comes back and then invents new tricks. Because I think the way Pikachu works. Okay, wait. This is the way I think about like gimmicky characters, like Pikachu, Yoshi. Yes, I think Yoshi's kind of gimmicky. Because if your character's not common and people don't know the matchup, your character's just gimmicky. That's just kind of how it goes. I'm not saying Axe is a gimmicky player. I'm saying Pikachu in itself can be a little cheesy and gimmicky. So like, this is a graph. It's just a line. Because I don't know how to do graphs. These guys just keep coming. So let's say, so like in 2019, let's say Axe got like here. This is just like Pikachu meta. He got like right here, right? And I think when he was doing well, the rest of the meta was like behind him. And now I think 20, 
20. I think Pikachu meta is probably still right here. But now people are over here, right? You know what I mean? But he's done this many times. And it's happened over the course of the years. Where like now he has to bring this game, this Pikachu meta up over here to be good. He has to stay above the meta. Or else his character sucks dick. He cannot be with the meta. He cannot be behind because Pikachu is bad. So in order for Axe to succeed, he needs to stay above and think of new tricks to, to constantly be good. Because he just got last. Because I think he's like right here and everyone's right here. And when you're playing a shitty character and this is the gap between how good you are and how good this is compared to this, you're just going to lose. <laughs> he needs to be a ahead of the curve every time to succeed. And I've thought this about Axe in 2015, 16, and then he always comes back fire. I just don't know if this is the end. If he hit like a wall. And I don't know if this is the end of X. Just because I think Pikachu's bad. I don't think Axe is bad. Don't don't go into a stream and say Mango thinks you're bad. I just think that Axe needs to stay above the curb. But I think people are so good that it's going to be hard for him. And I think he knows that being a Pikachu player. So I'm really interested to see him do more. I think... <sighs> We're not done yet. Hello, Joshua. I, 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 the thing is, Leffen brought up a good point. Like, he oh, he just plays really aggro, right? But, like, he, Leffen said something that kind of blew my mind. He's like, we haven't seen, like, the Wizrobe style for Pikachu. Meaning, like, if you look at Wizzy compared to the other Falcons. Like, think about Falcons. We've seen the Johnny type. We've seen the Nun type. And we've seen the Wizzy type. And we've all seen that they're really good. But with Pikachu, we've only ever seen Axe. That's all we know. And I think it's funny to bring up the Falcons because you see how on the spectrum they're all crazy. But I mean, think about it. Like, you can do that with, like, Falco. We haven't seen the Wizzy style of Falco, which might end up being fiction, weirdly enough. But, like, we haven't seen, like, the Wizzy style of Falcon. We haven't seen, like, the Nun style of Falco. We haven't seen, like, the Johnny. And I think the best way to describe this is, like, Nun is insane out of his mind. Johnny's kind of in the middle. And Wizzy's way over here. Very optimal, very flow charty. And I think that's a good way to compare. Like, we haven't seen, like, that style of each one. Ginger? I think Ginger is probably more on the Wizzy side, but with a hint of Mango. She's, like, a weird mix. But Wizzy, uh, Ginger's more there. Again, it's not, like, directly, but you know what I mean. Like, there's, like, I'm just using that, like, as the three. So, when you look at Pikachu, like, we haven't really seen, like, that very optimal defensive style Pikachu so maybe Axe can come up with like some defensive shit the problem is he's just so aggressive and you watch his other characters they just love to hold forward so I don't know I, I don't know you got some right there. Tree. Oh. Nice. Tree, uh, <laughs> later kid later Hold it upside down, it's melted. There's no way. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I can't imagine school now though with like Twitter. I would be like, I would just tweet like, Jackie has a fat ass. And it gets like three favorites. But then Jackie sees it, it's like, Oh my god, who am I? Gio, did you see? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I was somebody else for a second. <laughs> I didn't know who I was, and I, I got back to being Mango. <laughs> yeah, I'll be back. My dogs are going crazy. I think Lauren's gone, so they want to go out. I'll be back. Again, thanks. Dude, we got hella subs. A lot of resubs, a lot of gift subs, a lot of the whole shebang. You go outside? <gasps> you go outside? 
Let's go outside. Let's go outside. Dumbass, I'm not taking him outside. <laughs>